All right, we are going to learn more about Site Selection Magazine and how our rankings and how important it is and what does it really mean. Joining us today, he's Dave Stratton. Of course, he's President and CEO of Allen Economic Development Group. And thanks for coming. Hi, Holly. Great to be with you. Okay, so we hear about this magazine, Site sure. Selection, and this govern Governor's Cup. Mm -hmm. So what does that mean for, like, the normal people around here? I know you guys are all excited for economic sure. development, but what does that mean to us? What it, should, it should be more than just us being excited. It should really, really be for the whole community being, uh, you know, a place of celebration for all the things that are taking place in Lima Allen County and part of that is getting recognition like what's taking place with Site Selection Magazine of which they came out uh, every March they identify within the nation you know what areas what cities what states are hitting the rankings and we're right at the top yeah well, what are we number three this year right and, yeah and yep. it's tiered different metropolitan area sure. i guess i assume we're comparing size to size right sure sure let me kind of run with that a little bit so site selection magazine is an organization that does study of development throughout the nation they'll evaluate states and in the case of Ohio, Ohio ranked third in development projects, okay. and, it, it, okay. and Texas was number one. Okay. But then they'll start looking within the state of Ohio, uh, but they'll also look within throughout the nation as to different tiers. So there would be a micropolitan tier, that would be 50,000 population or less. If it's a third tier metropolitan, 50,000 to 150,000 population. Second tier would be 150 up to a million, and a million up would be top tier. Well, we happen to fall in the third tier metropolitan, okay. and this year, which would be 23, uh, we were ranked third in the nation in, in development projects. All right. That's, that's awesome. That is awesome. So, development projects, are we talking about the things that you come monthly and say, mm -hmm. hey, this person's expanding, we're building this, is that, is that what they're looking yeah, at? Yeah, absolutely. So, and we've talked a lot about the different companies, and, and I have to say this, we're blessed with a wide range of diverse companies in Lima Allen County, and so we'll look at these companies and what site selection will do, they'll look at companies like Logoplast, which we've talked about, mm -hmm. um, Chemtrade, um, really on and on. Logoplast is really a premium, one of them, because it's, you know, a new company that's come to town in the last few years. Right. Um, but the growth end, they'll look at, is it a million dollar capital investment for that year, 20,000 square feet of additional space, or 20 new employees? And we had last year 11 projects that hit that metrics. Wow. Uh, but I told, I told you earlier, um, I don't like to be third. I was going to say, yeah. Because, I don't like well, to be we've third. done pretty well in the past five years, though. Sure. Right? We've been ranked up there, you know, six, sure. three or whatever. So, mm -hmm. so how do you get to number one? I well, mean, that's, that's a lot of pressure well, we're gonna for you. We're going to work on it. We're going to work on it for sure. But when you look at uh, 2019, we were sixth in the nation. And people need to celebrate. People sometimes say, is there anything going on in Lyme Allen County? Sixth in the nation, 2019, fourth in 2020, 21, 22, and 23, we were third in the nation, and we're not going to be third in 24. Okay, the that's goal your goal. Is to, is we're going for up. two or one. Yep, okay, that's sure. what we're doing. But I think a lot of it's a matter of what's in the pipeline. And so you might say, what does 20, you know, 24 look like? I can tell you this, that there's companies investing major money in Lima Allen County. Just recently, if you remember uh, within the last two weeks, that one of our star companies, Synovus, oh, yes. is going to invest $1.5 billion in Synovus, Ohio. Okay, and a lot of that money will be coming to the plant at Lima. Mm -hmm. But they're not the only ones. When you're talking about companies like P&G and the growth that's taking place there, Nutrien continues to expand and do some really amazing things. So we're very hopeful that 24 will be a, a star as well and we'll move up the list. Right, yeah, and you'll just keep us informed every month. I, I think happening. so, I think so. And what, what we talked about a little bit earlier too, Holly, is the people need to know there is something here going on in Lima Allen County that in some respects is almost generational. There's positive things that are going on. So a lot of the development projects like downtown Lima yes. that was taking place, they, those are not even brought into the picture for Site Selection Magazine. Site Selection typically is looking at commercial properties, bigger companies, and so uh -huh. forth. But we have a lot to celebrate in Lima Allen County. It sounds like it. Thanks for explaining oh, it to us. Thanks for coming, good. Dave. Yeah, thanks, Holly. All right, don't go away. New Edition continues in a moment.